Hey, welcome back to my channel. My name is Alicia. Today I have a fashion haul for you guys. So let's get into fragrance. I am a fragrance girly. I love fragrances. Mostly I tie them with memories. You know how you can smell a scent and it just takes you back to a time like the 90s, cool water. And I'm also a big fan of Beyonce and she came out with her first perfume, I believe, called Say Noir. Now, let me tell you about this. Okay, so of course there was like this big hype all on social media. Fragrances, I gotta smell it, right? So my sister in love, Brittany, she wore this to Thanksgiving dinner and I just, it smells so good. It's definitely a sweet scent. It's more of a mature type of sweet scent. I am on the uh, Beyonce's official website because I wanted to get the correct notes for you guys. I absolutely love this scent. It is definitely nothing like I've, I've never smelled anything quite like it before. It's sexy. It's a mature, sweet, floral scent. So the next item I want to show you guys is an accessory. They're actually these earrings. Um, Jennifer Bear. Yeah, they're butterfly like dangly drop earrings. She has a few of these, so pretty. She also has like the three drop butterflies. Um, and then she has these, the two drop butterflies. And I wanted something kind of like in between. Something that I could, you know, definitely wear when I wanted to dress up, but also something that I could wear when I am um, wearing something a bit more casual. And it's so crazy how the universe works, right? You know, the string theory. I initially saw them on this girl that is based out of like Europe. She does like cinematography videos. Think of her name, but if I can, I will link her channel in the description box. Kind of like screenshot, put it in my wish list. You know, it's all the Bottega earrings. They were really trendy. Everybody was wearing them. So I was like, okay, you know, let me order some too. I mean, I don't hate the Bottega earrings. I feel like God was saying, are you a leader or are you a follower? Do you really like these earrings or are you getting these earrings because they're popular? The answer was I was just getting them because they were popular. You know, at this age of 39, I am still looking and trying to discover my style. Moving right along. Let's get into shoes. Love these sandals from Target. Aren't they just so cute? The florals, they're on trend. They also have these in heels. If you prefer like a nice little kitty heel, cute. The next pair of shoes I purchased from Zara. So these are a size, it's a 42, is a 42 a 12? Cause I know I don't wear no dang on 12. Y'all are really doing the most. I feel like clear shoes are like a nude. For the bling may kind of like throw things off, but these are really good basics. Wear with jeans, with a blazer, with a gown. Oh, love these. So now let's get over to the clothes. I'm excited because I have not recorded long form content in forever. <laughs> I had to pull out my bag from out the attic. I had like hung it up, gave up on content creating. Like I wasn't getting the support that I desperately need. Okay, I just, I just felt like I was running in circles. This is me getting back into the swing of things. Okay, so the first piece is from Timu and oh my God. Okay, let's talk about Timu because initially I didn't know. My husband actually placed his first order and I was like, what? You know, he's not that guy. I actually purchased this for a wedding. Um, it's like a dark hunter green, and then you have kind of like distorted flowers on it from Timu, and it had to be like $9, like $9. It is a high-low dress. I feel like it's perfect for church. A very conservative, very feminine dress. I don't feel like you will um, offend anyone if you wore this. It's just a really nice lady dress. So the next dress I ordered from TikTok shop and it's one of those viral TikTok dresses, okay? Initially, I thought I was gonna wear it to the wedding, but it's just a little too sexy for the wedding. And it's in that same green color 
and you have the white florals. It's a uh, floor length dress, even for me. I'm 5'11", so it's a pretty long dress. And it's like spaghetti straps. It has all of these multiple straps. There is a zipper in the back. It's a really cute feminine dress, but it is a lot. It is body form figure hugging even for my husband my husband is a man okay in every aspect and in every way he is a man okay for my husband to say that this is too much for the wedding speaks a lot okay you guys actually comes from nordstrom's rack <laughs> my husband played a trick on me he told me the wedding started at 3 and it didn't start at 4 30. So I arrived at this wedding at like 2.30 and I'm like, where is everybody at? But what I did was I went around the corner to, to Nordstrom's Rack and this is what I saw. And it's just this beautiful maxi dress. It's so feminine. I love the color. I love the fit of it. I love the ruffles. It's just everything feminine, summer, sundress season. It's just the best time of the year. I ordered this dress from Halara. If you know me, know me, you know that I have advocated for Halara since I partnered with them on my first channel. They're rebuilding here. I stand for Halara. Now, I like Lululemon and I also like Target. Those are good alternatives. But Halara, when it comes to their dresses, they just have it. They just have it. So I saw this red number. It's the last year of my 30s. Like, what does she look like at 39? Like 38 going into 39. Like, you know, it's an interesting time when you're like knocking on 40, but you still in your 30s. This is, this is YouTube. Y'all like long-term content over here, long-form content. So I'm keeping all of this in here, okay? My last video, I spoke about red and how I'm not a big fan of wearing red, right? Because it's such a powerful color that attracts a lot of attention and authority and power and boldness and it's just not my color. I am a blue girl. This is me all day. I love it. But I've also been doing color analogy and color theory. I'm a summer girl, okay? My colors are gold. My colors are um, green and orange and amber. There are certain reds that just, in my opinion, they compete with my skin color. They don't complement my skin color. I do better with like a dark fuchsia. I think that's more me as a summer girl. And I will come back and do a color analogy, but I will just give you a few pointers here. You wanna start with gold and silver accessories. And you wanna put them both up to your face to see which one looks better. So either the gold is gonna look better or the silver. And for me, gold looks best on me. But I'm stepping out and I'm trying something new. So I got this dress from TikTok Shop. So all of their dresses come with the little shorts underneath. And this is the new design where you can pull the shorts down if you need to use the restroom. So their older design, you have to take the whole dress off. So keeping red in mind, purchase from Lululemon. Um, it's just, I think I got this around Valentine's Day. It's just a pair of their aligned leggings and then just this tank to go with it. It's going to be my birthday dress. I saw this dress on Miss Lisa's channel. I love her here on YouTube. I've watched her forever. I was like, that's it. That is the birthday dress. I got it from Zara. I ordered this in a size large. Large does it's pretty heavy, you know. It's it's heavy. It's not a light dress. It it's just a good weight. It's a good fit. It's a good look. Zara has been on it. I don't know who's over there working. I've been on it. So this is another dress. Look, it's giving me 70s. Is leopard print back in? 
I feel like leopard print never goes out of style. Leopard print is a neutral for me because you can just wear it with anything. Now I haven't tried this on. Um, when I first opened it up, I felt like I should have gotten like an extra large for the length, if nothing else, because I told y'all I'm 5'11". So this is going to be short on me. Moving right along is another leopard print maxi dress from Zara. And I was like, yes, it is so beautiful. I love the way it feels and flows. When I think of 39 going into 40, this is what I think of. I think of the longer maxi dresses that flow, summer dresses, sundresses that, you know, are still sexy, but it's not looking like you're trying so hard. Lastly, good old Betsy Johnson. Do we still like Betsy Johnson? How do we feel about Betsy? I remember when Betsy Johnson was a rave. I just still love her. I love Betsy Johnson. I love her energy, her style. I just feel like she's the good example of coloring outside of the lines, living your life, and just being in your truth, right? Figured again that this could be something that I could wear date night or either at home. I like to wear little dresses like this around the house. I'm doing nothing when I'm cooking or cleaning. When I see satin dresses or slip dresses, I kind of feel like they look like, you know, nightgowns. Maybe that's a hat. Wear them like on a Sunday when you're not doing anything, you're not going anywhere, but you don't want to be sitting up with a bonnet on and like an oversized t-shirt. This is like an elevated nightgown, a walking around the house type of look. I'm attempting to do is not just dress up for the outside. I am a married woman. I've been married twice, not trying to be married three times. So I've been challenging myself on the days like today. Today is Sunday. I got up and I threw on this little outfit right here. Now this is a jumpsuit. My neighbor, she gave me a big bag of clothes. Most of them, the majority of them were brand new from like, it's fashion. Just remember, it's fashion. So I'm like, okay, you know what? I think I'm gonna, we have one not too far from here. I'm gonna stop by there and just see what they have. Look at this. Just live for pieces like this. I'm like, you know what? We're gonna have a nice little date night and I'm gonna wear this. I just think it's beautiful. I just think it's gorgeous. It moves like water, right? Make me sweat. It just moves like liquid gold. This is a beautiful dress and it also comes in pink. Really pretty. So I just wanna close this video out with that. I will see you guys on the next video. Thank you for watching. Make sure you subscribe, hit that thumbs up button, comment down below which outfit did you like the best? And I will see you guys in the next video.